We open with a specific murder case, a tragic killing that occurred within the grounds of the academy at that the girls attended. Based on their understanding of the crime scene, the police ruled the incident was the work of a pervert who snuck into the school grounds. However, there was a secret behind the incident. Even before the janitor first discovered the body, there were students who witnessed the crime itself. The students were five high school girls. They didn't want to get involved in the incident, so they tried to hide the fact they were the first to discover it. However, tragedy befell those girls. Several days after the incident, one of the five girls, Girl E, is murdered by someone. What in the world happened at this once peaceful academy? By playing the missing first day and third day, you'll be able to understand that mystery. All the answers you seek are hidden in this truth edition. Will you be able to reach the truth? Buy the DLCs for $19.95 each now. Oh, sorry, that was the EA version of the game. Anyway, now then, let's start off with the first day when it all began. When does Sub-Zero unlock as a character in this game? And how much does he cost? <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm really, really sorry for keeping you all waiting. Jeez, we're gonna go home late because we had to wait for Slowpoke Girl A. Come on, Girl B, you don't have to be that mad. Huh? I'll go take your photos without our permission. People might mistake us for good friends. It, I'm not your friend? <laughs> I'm not your friend. No, fuck you, bitch. <clears throat> what? There's no way I'd ever be friends with a trashy, nasty, pig shit like you. What the fuck is going on in this game? She called her a pig shit. Wow. Okay. ta -ha! The way girl B treat people, even loan sharks looking to collect would get sick into their stomachs. Huh. Is girl E here yet? Ah, apparently she forgot something. She told us to wait just a little longer. She can't find her school swimsuit. Her swimsuit, huh? Maybe it got stolen? Stolen? You don't know? A pervert has been spotted in the area recently. You should be super careful, girl A. A chubby weakling like you makes the perfect prey. Stop it. Girl A is getting really scared. Yeah, it's funny to bully. It's fun to bully girl A. What was that sound? Sounded like glass breaking. Sounds like it came from the second floor. Let's go! This game's gonna turn into Night Trap. We have to set traps to catch guys with dildo guns. What's this soundtrack? Doodle this is, this is a remix of, remix of one of the Danganronpa theme songs from the first game. <laughs> Girl E, what happened? I don't know. I walked by the front of the music room just now, and then I suddenly heard the sound of glass breaking. Someone in there? Oh my god, excuse me. That's what I think about. The, the door's locked. I can't get it open. You're right. It's locked. Did someone lock it from the inside? Is someone really in there? Um, if we use the key from the teacher's lounge, we can open this door, right? I'll go to the teacher's lounge and get the key to the music room. The teachers are probably gone by now, so I'm sure we can bring the key over in secret. Well, I had a bad feeling about this. Uh, I found the key. Nobody was there, so it was super easy to get. Well, let's open it right away. <clears throat> Creek. Okay. Girl A, you lead the way. Uh, me? Come on, hurry, hurry. Oh. I actually had to do it. I can't take my eyes off this. Wait a minute. There's no baseball bat at all. Look. There's gla something's glass. That almost looks like an aquarium or something. Right? But there's no baseball bat whatsoever. Someone's laying on the floor. <clears throat> She's not laying down. She's dead. 
dead? That's impossible. Why? Kya! Lower your voice. They might still be nearby. Nearby? I mean, this looks like someone murdered her. Murdered, huh? Seriously, shut up. What's gonna happen if the killer notices us? What should we do? What should I do? Alright, that's what's happened. I found out the killer's escape route. Escape route? Could it be? What, the, the hole in the wall? The window was broken. The sound we heard from the entrance hall was probably the window breaking. Someone probably locked the music room door from the inside after killing this girl. They broke the window and escaped outside. Looks like she got hit by something when she died, but I can't seem to find anything bloody here. What happened to the weapon? Did the killer take it? So, the killer just ran out of the window? But, if they just wanted to run away, they could have opened the window. Why'd they have to break it? They're probably trying to leave in a hurry. Look, there's evidence. The fish tank by the window is tipped over, and all the gravel is scattered. They must have accidentally tipped it over when they were frantically trying to get away. Okay. Broken fish tank has been added to the truth bullets section of your handbook. It's not too high to jump from the second floor, so maybe they thought it'd be safer than using the hallway. But, is that really it? I mean, to lock the door, you have to either lock it from the inside the music room or use the lounge key. When I went to get the music room key, it was in the teacher's lounge. So the killer wouldn't have had time to return the key before they broke the window. Then the door could have been locked from the inside. That means the killer was inside the music room. Also, to get outside from the music room, they need to have passed by us in the entrance hall. But we didn't see anyone pass by, which means the killer's only escape route was this window. <clears throat> Killer's escape route has been added to the truth bullet section of your handbook. It's probably that pervert I heard about. He's the one who snuck inside the school grounds. Huh? My school swimsuit was stolen. I couldn't find it anywhere. Then the pervert who stole Girl E's swimsuit also murdered that girl over there. They probably locked the music room so they could rape her, but she ended up resisting. So they frantically tried to get away, broke the window, and escaped? Huh. The stolen school swimsuit is added to the truth bullet section of your handbook. Isn't it bad if we stay here much longer? I mean, I don't want to get involved in something like this, and the killer might still be around too. That's bad, uber bad, we better hurry up and run! But, we don't have to report this to the police. Do you know what happens when you report this kind of stuff to the police? You become the prime subject just suspect just before you found the body first. I definitely don't want that. Alright, be best if we left the room, how we found it, lock the door, leave everything how it was. Hey, please wait, don't leave me. Hmm. They left Girl D with the body. The third day. Oh my god, so we're, we're skipping the middle day. It's gonna be kind of confusing here. Alright. Girl D! Sorry, did I make you wait? What's up? You asked me to meet here. Don't, don't tell me you're gonna confess your love to me. Uh, what happened? Um, I want you to look at this photo. Whoa! What is that? On the day of the incident, I found this when I peeked into the next door classroom as I was going home. What the fuck is it? I have no idea what that's supposed to be. Flowers? I don't know. <clears throat> I couldn't help taking a picture. What do you think these broken vase pieces mean? This is a broken vase. It's supposed to be a broken vase, I guess. Okay, uh, let's see. 
What is this? Uh, I don't know anything about this vase. If that's the case, the killer didn't escape from the window. Seriously, I don't know anything. It's okay, I made sure to throw it away. Huh? If anyone found it, you'd be in trouble, right, girl E? Are you trying to blackmail me? Of course not. That's not what this is about. If there's something you're hiding from me, I want you to say it. I mean, we're friends, right? You didn't say anything either. I knew, you know. I knew the girl who got killed was tormenting you. Huh? No, she wasn't just tormenting you. She was seriously making your life a living hell. All right, so what you're trying to say here, all right, is it was really girl D murdered this other girl for basically being a horrendous bully to her, and then she covered it up herself to make it look like a killer had escaped out of the window, when in reality it was hers doing the whole thing, setting the whole thing up. Okay, I get it now. 